da, 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 da. Do this. <clears throat> no, thank you. Well, hey, welcome back, guys. Welcome to the channel. My name's Twice, and this is Mario plus Rabbids, Cross Rabbids, Mario Rabbids, if you're a Hunter Hunter fan. Sparks of Hope, the sequel. That, the most unlikely sequel I think I've seen in a long time. But, uh, one that I enjoy nonetheless. Very excited. Welcome in. Settle in. It's going to be a long one. Maybe not today, but the, the game itself, for sure. Uh, for those of you who missed it, the first Mario Rabbids game was a, uh, turn-based strategy grid system a la XCOM and uh, was way better than it really had any right to be. It was a lot of fun. We didn't play the initial game on stream but we did play the DLC, the Donkey Kong DLC, which I thought was pretty good. Um, added in some difficulty, some new characters and strategy and uh, in general I just Enjoyed it. I think everyone did. Um, this one... Very much... The similar but different. We've got, instead of a grid-based system, we've got a free range of motion system. A la, say... Divinity Original Sin. Or Baldur's Gate 3, um, which isn't out yet, so why am I citing it as a source? I'm excited, because it seems like they increased the customization of the characters a lot, which means that we can build our own characters however we decide to. As opposed to kind of one tree of just general betterness that we got in the first game. And you might be wondering... Someone misplaced Rabid Mario's overalls. Disastrous. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Um, those of you wondering, hey, this is still October, I thought we were doing spooky horror games. Well, first of all, we did two of them get off my case but b in this one the rabbits apparently talk like voice act full voice acting so there you go horrific the most horrific game we've played ever in fact i'm very excited let's go find rabid mario's overalls sure Consider sounds done, good my beloved princess we are happy to serve an overall nice day Shake, shake. You had you open ready to go on my bladder betray. You didn't miss anything. My bladder betrays me all the time, so I understand. Is there a run button? Nope. This is as fast as we go. Better get used to it. That one does look particularly sparkly. We've done it. They're nature's piggy banks. Okay. Built a spaceship. There's Rabid Kong in the background. I wonder if we're going to get any cameos. I mean, the fact of the matter is Bowser exists now um, as a main character you can play as. And... Wait, you stole Rabid Mario's overalls? But why? I wanted to be the only Rabid with overalls so badly. Makes sense. Hold X to boost. Yay! Oh, X is run. Okay. Sure, why not? And worse. Hurry, hand me my overalls. I'm a back. Boop, 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 boop. Into 
probably should have hit them somewhere else. Yes. You just want to be like Rabbit and Mario, but only one of us can look this good in casual alternatives to pants. All's well that ends well. Now we can enjoy this beautiful day in peace and harmony. Adventure complete. We can now kick back and relax, safe in the knowledge that everything is under control. Oh no, I forgot. The Luma's got rabbit fog. Rest in, rest in peach. Okay, maybe they don't talk. <laughs> I heard they had full voice acting, but maybe Peach doesn't talk at all. <laughs> I might be excited most about the uh, the music than anything else. They've got some absolute studs doing the music in this one, besides Grant Kirkhope. Got some Kingdom Hearts composer, got the Ori and the Blind Forest composer. Uh oh, strike the words casual, strong, and don't panic. We've got hostiles incoming! Mario, take cover and don't get caught out in the open. Get behind cover. Yep. Yeah. Well, taking cover, you can aim, see how enemies hit the Alright. Dual Slinger, 25 percent 20 chance for a crit. One target or two separate ones confirm the first target to select a second. Oh. So you could jump back and forth with these doobies. Hmm. Alright. Bunch of zero percent. But you can knock that down to half. I don't know what that was, but I didn't like it. Focus on getting to her now by moving to the tip of the mantis tip. Well, you know, there are worse ways to pull off a tutorial. In the back of a giant curse manta that reminds me of Super Mario Sunshine. I don't know about Beepo's new voice, though. <laughs> Alright, they do have Dash. We absolutely smoked some people with Dash, with like, rabid 
Luigi? Yoshi? I can't remember. You can throw them at the creature's orb-shaped eyeball protuberances. It's weak spot. I love protuberances. Live streaming! <laughs> no worries. Okay. Okay, I'm remembering that. You see jump to reach last iron dear. Team jump appears to be free to move around while in the air. Just be aware of the timer. Oh. Close from team jump, standing still next to another hero, you reveal the maximum team jump distance. One hero enters and two another hero's highlighted in yellow. Shoe icon for the latter will be highlighted. Hmm. I think, I mean, Red Red Peach was like the, I don't know if it was bipolar or what, but the most popular character in the game. Guessing you're gonna teach me about cover. The sport. Reactivated. Time to take cover. Take aim and fire at those baddies. Just beware that this dimension works quite differently than our own. You cannot move after you shoot. Is that how they're going with the uh, changes in the tactics? There's a chance system. Yep. Someone just can bypass partial cover to hit any still behind them. Or shoot, can't move anymore. So be sure to take cover first. Oh yeah! They cannot stress that enough. <laughs> yeah, you know, one's up. One out two's not bad. Triple Troll fires three projectiles. Curve trajectory, so it's just 100%. Ignores partial cover. All right. <laughs> They're on the open, I think they take extra damage. I can't fully remember the maybe not. Oh, this is this is gonna be a journey of everybody. This is still 
the weirdest crossover I think I've ever seen. And I've seen a few in my in my time. You got your indie game crossovers that are just kind of like guest characters. Then you got full games that fit really well together, like Ace Attorney and Professor Layton, or Street Fighter and Tekken. Tetsunoko versus Kenneth, that's just a fighting game, don't worry about it. Um, that seems bad. Mario plus Rabbids. Sorry, Mario plus the extremely annoying, uh, overplayed mascots that originally were just enemies in a single Rayman game. <laughs> it's gotta be top tier weird. Cursa. Thanks, Starburst. I prefer the pink ones. We only escaped it now. It won't stop chasing. <gasps> this cursor is well out of range. The energy readings I'm picking up from it are beyond my ability to measure. <laughs> Power up my attacks. We'll take all the help we can get. Mario, be short. Remember that both of you have your signature techniques at your disposal. I have a feeling you're going to need them. Okay. Now you can choose between attack, techniques, and sparks. That's a new one. I wonder what the fourth option is. Remember that each year has two action points each turn. I'm forget about dash. These moon abilities do not consume action points, but they have their own counters. If you reach a better position, you can also use team jump. Also doesn't consume action points, but it also has our own counters. Okay. I could probably team jump all the way across here. What's my uh, what's my signature? What's the spark do? Allies within range deal 20% more damage with attacks and movement abilities. Hero sight targets movement within range, and hero's line of sight are dealt 100% damage to super effects. It's like an Overwatch. Got it. So I'm gonna do this. Strangely intense. And then get a chance at the second. Pretty cool. Alright, Peach. Doesn't have a spark right now, that's fine. What's. It was the heal, right? Got it. Can I make my way around this? Is that, is that what you're telling me? You vault this? Alright. Not sure if this was the right call. I just kind of wanted to see how it went. Did we get two attacks then? No. One shot. Do not miss your chance to go. Yeah. All right. Understood. Not who I was hoping would go first, but that's fine. Is it just a one overwatch? Yep, yeah, okay, makes sense. Alright, 
And we'll do that. And we'll just. It's 100%, right? It's a frustratingly small amount of XP left over. So, they only have voice acting in the in the battles, and then there's still, like, mute Lego characters, or heaven forbid, minions, in any of the cutscenes. I can pr I can deal with that. Welcome, Mario and Rabbit Peach. It is fortunate that you are unharmed. Your safety is critical to our mission. Hey, hello! Remember me? The entity who created you? I'm alive too! Also fortuitous, but with a critical success factor that is lower in comparison by 31.732193%. <laughs> Forgive Jeannie here for her arrogance, everyone. As the ship's new artificial intelligence, she just became self-aware yesterday. Obviously, I have a lot more testing to do, but seeing as how we're an emergency situation here, I... Uh -huh. <laughs> hey, widow fella! Interesting. It appears that this creature is equal parts rabid and luma. A it can take a combination. of harnessable energy as a result. I suspect there are more of them scattered throughout the galaxy, though without more data, the exact number cannot be determined. The, the exact number is too many. There's too many. <laughs> Ooh, how could this happen? Rosalina would never have allowed this. Okay, so Rosalina's Cursa. I think that's pretty much going to be the uh, guarantee, I assume. She's in trouble because of Cursa. Please help her. Please. Oh, that's definitely Rosalina. That's Rosalina like evil Empress vibes, though, which, you know, good for her. Cursa is conquering the galaxy using a corruptive energy called Darkness. I can pinpoint the epicenter <laughs> of this activity. Cursa's stronghold. It will take our ship an eternity to travel the distance between our current location and the stronghold. Okay, it looks like five, five planets. However, using a purified form of darkness energy, we could create a series of warp Does she believe that in a thing called love? Almost Just what I was about to suggest to our friend here. Hmm, what do we call your kind? Aha! Uh -huh. How about rabid lumas? You can't just keep adding rabid to the end of things, Beepo. Really? Sparks. Because objectively speaking, I think rabid lumas is kind of perfect, no? Bleh. It stinks. <laughs> the closest planet within range is Beacon Beach. The dark mess has already spread there. Not enough data to define the level of danger. Please, Genie, adventure may be new to you. So, five, five plants I worth of stuff? The difficulty of this mission to be... Demanding! Of course I reserve the right to change my mind at any point during our mission. Regardless, with the rabbit... It's a strategy game, I have to... I have to do smooth. hard mode. Like, I gotta. I believe the consensus was... Sparks. No, whatever! What matters is we have the help. Listen, now that Cursor Can't wait to get my overalls handed right back to me in the first mission we do. Oh my. 
of those creatures. Bring them to me. Well, I assume those would be the three more playable characters. So we got Bowser, we got Rabid Rosalina. Rosalina conspicuously absent. And... Edge, which is a new rabbit, something I'm not sure anybody asked for, but uh, you know, we're getting anyways, so. Cardboard. <laughs> Should cause trouble. We're at our limit already. Put that away. We're heroes, not a What kind of Poseidon are we? Heroes? You mean like the put yourself in serious danger to help total strangers kind of heroes? Bingo, 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 baby! <laughs> Why do they only have him say the first sentence? Um, <laughs> here, uh, <laughs> Got some minor problems I could use help with. See that thing on our lighthouse? Yeah, it looks great. Mm. Right the sun disappeared the second it showed up and snuffed out our lighthouse that signal fire. It's a darkness tentacle. By eliminating it, not only can we reverse its ill effects on the weather, thanks, Genie, but we can purify its darkness energy and use it to create a warp tunnel to our next destination. We must also eradicate any and all darkness puddles. They won't yield purified darkness energy, but they are still a threat. I can't imagine them saying darkness oh. so seriously oh. all the time. Stop in the village first under siege by a horrible menace, but we need to get on it for a while. Augie's request is compatible with our mission. I have detected a spark in the village as well. We should make contact. Okay. Spark? Oh, you are way larger than I thought you were. They could have done us both favor and stayed home too. Well, we're all here. This trouble in the village sounds like a two-hero job, not including myself, of course. Easy as pie. Let's get it over with before my nano dial start to rust. Who's with me? First glance around, right? Okay, I will do that. Here's the next stop of our main quest. Check all the able quests. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, we're on this island. Okay. Yep, that, yep, that, that, sure, yeah, that's a planet. The Goomba with the pot on its head. Secret Zone. Arch of Darkness. Memories. Memories. All right. Oh, these are right, 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 right. In the story so far, that was right. We we fought Bowser. I remember. Progression. There are thirty sparks in this game. There's seventy-two memories. Five planet keys. Does sound like there's five planets. Anyways. Team Heal, you can heal your entire party in exchange for a few coins. Also, service offered by SalesBot, $9.99 plus tax to merchant. <laughs> yeah, alright. 
What did I just press? What have I done? Sneak attacker. Pest. <laughs> just... <laughs> oh, everyone's level goes up the same way. Oh, that is perfect. That is so good for build combinations. It's not even funny. Reflector. Upgrade. Oh, you feed them star bits just like in Galaxy. Hmm. Very interesting. Except the fact that X is tied. Hello, what's this? You're not telling me? That's fine. Don't need to. This planet seems bigger than... Hello, that's a big oh. egg. Than you'd expect. It does kind of seem like we should save Beacon Tower first, though. What happens if I do this? I mean, if Rabid Mario's got a Brooklyn accent, I think I'd be alright with it. He's walking me. I just wanted to see what that would be. I'm glad that they've brought in team management and choose how to bring on your team. Soft ones. Team with one strong ass favorite. Team of heroes without any restrictions. Cool. Why am I only allowed two characters? Unclear. I'm guessing that'll change. Let's replace Mario with Rabid Mario. Perfect. I don't know. Let's try them out. Dash, pick up, throw a bomb to deal a lot of damage. What's my ability? Foes using weapon attacks are immediately counterattacked. That's rude. Oh, you've got the right. You got the fists. What is Tacticam? It's nonsense, what it is. What is this? Weaken effects, reducing the damage they cause, okay. Yeah, I could dash, but what's this? Disruptor. This disc can hit up to three targets sequentially, ignores partial cover. Right. I'm just gonna be rude there. I didn't notice him at all. That was horrible, thank you. Skill prism obtained. Just unlocked for skill prism. You can use them in the skill tree to empower here. Okay. Show me. Inundate me with stuff. 
this is the time to do it. You can just upgrade your heroes' abilities during the battle. Skill prisms are the currency. You can spend to activate upgrades. Each hero has their own set of skill prisms. They can be used and refund at any time with no cost. Find the skill tree inside the heroes tab. Customize. So just uh, health. Recovers extra HP after winning a battle. Increase healing. Movement, we got extra time after a team jump. We got just extra movement in general. Dashes apply and weaken. Extra dashes, okay, makes sense. Critical hit chance, weapon damage, ricochet distance. Oh, for the, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Extra targets, okay. Exhaust takes less turns, range of effectiveness increase, further improve that. Vulnerable particles can also take more damage, and then we don't know what the last one is. Hmm. Two additional hits to opponents, able to move even after attacking. Hmm. Extra dashes. Mario's dash has an area of effect damage. So I really appreciate the animation here as well. I know we're we've we're barely starting here, but I'm I'm interested in all that. So the area can just grow up, I mean, pretty ridiculous. Be a fun character. Hero sight damage. I probably won't actually touch any of this just yet. Just extra overwatch. Bonus charge anytime you defeat an opponent. That's really good. Uh, first shot defeats an opponent, the second shot will deal extra damage. You can target and attack an opponent while gliding in the air. Wow, that's pretty cool. The mustache of Rabid Mario has to grow as he gets more powerful. You can stomp on an enemy while gliding. Glide after stomping. Increase the number of stops. Okay. All right. Peach. Sorry, a rabbit peach. Increase the range. Final damage on the third rocket. Weapon defeat will heal rabbit peach. Da 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 da. Heal takes few returns to recharge. Super effective on heroes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. First landing during a turn. Oh, you heal in an AoE. Okay. The Luigi. Increase the number of team jumps Luigi can perform in a turn. Area movement just increases. Extra dash after performing a team jump. Okay, extra damage on that. Decreases the damage drop off at close range. Okay. Oh, he's got a bow now. Increases critical chance when you target opponent from high ground. Okay. Steely stare. They did they canonize his really angry look from Mario Kart Eight here. And then there's Peach. Team barrier must turn to recharge. Additional barrier charges. Area of effect whenever a team barrier is discharged. Oof, the boombrella. Wider angle of attack. 
All right. All right. The only only one I can uh, currently confirm as a thing I want is uh, that. Plus, you can refund at any time. So, okay. Apologies for uh, no sparks equipped. Looking through that for so long, but. Those are quite the... There's an item bag in combat, and you can use an item to boost your strategy. You only use one item per turn, and it'll cost an action point. Alright. These concert tickets are costing me a fortune. The bottom rung of darkness. Alright. That sounds like a knockoff of Heart of Darkness. It's like machine translated. Heal my team. Why did I do that? For 85 coins. That was that was a waste. Alright, so you get the bash. Maybe, honestly, I'm wondering if we just kind of chill out for this turn. The bomb bombs are a little spooky. Instead, we just counter blow and Sounds like Hollow Bastion or something. Can the bombs don't have ears yet? Yet, yeah, I guess is the. I'm targeting range. All right. What does the POW block do? Shockwave once thrown deals area damage to everything in its vicinity. I guess they wanted more Mario in it. So they have actual Mario enemies in. That's 100%, right? Yeah, that won't hit. Does destroying a bomb -omb count? forward. Cool. Anyways, um... Yeah, I'm awesome. So... I already did it, so I can't, uh, I've goofed. Well, better to learn now than later, I suppose. Ha! 
This will literally hurt us, but... You know, we had to learn our lesson. Oi! Take it easy. I, I I think I'm I Rabbit Mario's grown up. Take it easy. How's <laughs> mama? Six out of eight, right? That should do it. Never enough. Well, it's still better than the one for the movie. Aw. Why you gotta do Chris Pratt like that? He worked really hard to sound slightly Boston slash Brooklyn. That movie is just so heckin' perfectly cast that I I just don't care. It looked pretty. If it's anywhere close to mediocre, I'll be there to, uh, you know, consume product. was just seven, which is really bothering me, because isn't there usually eight red coins? It's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. No, it's too bad. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, Rabbit Mario's growing on me. Okay. What do we got over here? Arch of Darkness? Okay. You like him? He has all the range of a portal. <laughs> oh, there's a there's an image I didn't need in my head, but thank you, appreciate it. I mean, like Keegan Michael Key as Toad, Jack Black, Spouser, <laughs> Seth Rogen as Donkey Kong, How can... Charlie Day as Luigi. I will be fine. And if the animation is gorgeous and there's a lot of different, like... You can knock them all over just for that turn, huh? Neat. If the animation's good, it won't matter. I don't know. Seems like the animators have love, so we'll see how it goes. If it's not good, you know, that's also fine. It just goes into the the bin with the one from the 80s. 90s? Alright, so let's work our way here, because we know you can't do this, so we've got... You got a team jump here. Just so you can get this dash off. And you can do this, I think. See ya. The nineties Mortal Kombat films. Yeah, I suppose, but like at the very least. The uh, Mortal Kombat films gave us that techno theme, and that's something I'll always be thankful for. It's just skills around here. Good stuff. Good stuff. 
Honestly, we might as well just try a bunch of different combos right now. They're so bad, they're funny as well, I suppose. Yeah, I mean, same with the Street Fighter movie, right? Because you at least had... I forget who acted for... Victor is sorry to be a wowser, mates, but all sporting contests are postponed due to the weather. I swim. Somewhat, is I suppose the answer. But M. Bison's actor went way harder than he had any need to do in that game. Movie. Based on a game. I don't know how to uncover that. I also don't know this is. Oh my god, so many. Possibilities. How to break that? Nobody knows. Triangle. Oh, I think I've discovered it. Beacon Tower, you know, it'll it'll be fine for a little while. That seagull might not be. It looks like it's part two can. Very happy there's not a an anatomically current butthole at the end of that. Very much appreciated. The darkness outside the lighthouse. I don't know how to destroy you. I have figured out how to destroy you. Level four is a little spooky. I'm going to definitely do it anyways. But it's pretty spooky. He was dying as well. It was to be his last major movie, so he gave it his all. I mean, bless him for it, because... Whew, was that something. Honestly... It looks like, let's try, like, Luigi plus, uh, Peach. Protecting plus long range style, and then we'll have tried all six. For at least a couple rounds each. And the ease at which you can switch around is so nice, though. Because if you get, uh, stuck on something... You might think, oh, well, actually, this just needs more shields, or we needed longer range stuff, and you can just swap it. So what do you do? 20% damage intended for the year is redirected towards the enemy. Interesting. Here's moving the range, and here's line of sight, or dealt 100% damage to sunny super thing. Okay, so it's very similar to... Got it. Give me that stare. <laughs> Terrifying. It's just gonna be fast forwarded forever, you know what? Fine with that. That sounded like Overwatch was activated. Um which we do not like. Okay. Let's see how far we can get with this team jump. 
Actually, I mean... Is that really zero percent? I just back up. I mean, I guess I could pow block. Just kind of... I think that grabs both of them on range. Sure does. Take like a little bit of damage, that's fine. Got a barrier. I'm still overwatching, huh? I didn't just want them to stay up here, but they're hiding themselves well. Ish. Full cover, at least. Again. Sure are. Why wouldn't you? Actually, let's uh back off here for a second, cause we can do that go here. How much would this do? Oh my god, so much. That works out. And we uh Shoot you, Overwatch. Oh, that's long enough. I've been looking forward to watching this class. Seems a decent game. Me too. I was very happy when the reviews came out. Everyone seemed to enjoy the different strategies the game added compared to the original, which was kind of a solved game eventually. That's why I liked the DLC was because it was all you know unsolved. I'm gonna reflect here because I think we're about to get hit with an Overwatch shot. Yeah, there were uh, a couple of reviews came out today. Not not so good. 
Not not so good. Also, not really unexpected. Um, I don't think I should do that. Tales from the Borderlands. Sorry, new Tales from the Borderlands. Naming it like it's a new Nintendo console. Um. Without, um, please. Hello. Oh, wait, I should dash first. Okay. Now, hello. <laughs> so I guess I wasn't unexpected that it didn't go well, because they weren't using Telltale's writing staff to, like, live in their interesting world. They're trying to write a serious game, and they haven't written a serious game ever. Unless you count Alien Colonial Marines, which... Serious... <sighs> Debatable. Seriously buggy? Yeah, definitely. And then, uh, Gotham Knights, which... Yeah, yeah. It went about as you'd expect, by all accounts. I'll stick with the original Tales from the Borderlands, thank you. I enjoyed that one thoroughly. Planet Coin Awarded. Hmm. Sounds good. Now, what is this? It's not how you use ladders. Ah. Need a key. Alright, I suppose. Let's let's go up to the main drag. Yeah, and Gotham Knights, I mean... I didn't have any hopes for that either. Isn't Tales of Vesperia... No, of course not. We play the Definitive Edition. Obviously. Gwen. Graphics, all that matters. Why not? What <laughs> that just happened? Okay, sure, yeah. <laughs> Didn't expect to have a quick time event thrown in there. Um Gotham Knights poster and has everywhere all over town. Well, you know, at least they're doing an ad push, but it just... I have... no hope for it in the first place, so, you know, it'd be A-OK. -okay. It'd be alright. Pretend it doesn't exist. Probably that one. Okay. No targets within range. That's okay. I don't think we'll need them. Somehow that didn't didn't need to explode. Okay. Yeah, sure. Y'all know the only upcoming game that matters is the new Star Ocean. Of course. How are you today? 
take one. Thought it was the new Valkyrie profile. Oh no, that came out already. Nice work getting rid of that bomb. I was worried it'd kaboom the poor creature I found. See, there was some lighthouse can only be unlocked by the sun with it gone. It can't get inside normally. Luckily for you, this clever little cook makes its own light. Spookster. It's already released. You got me. Come on up. Do your jump. Oh my goodness. How athletic of you. What do we got here? Do my audio-visual capacitors deceive me? Or do I see some discerning customers with an eye for quality here? My usual customers, they have what I call value blindness. For them, I put out factory returns, overstock items. Still, they do nothing but haggle over price and badger me over reward points. Me, with six little peddler bots at home. I can't afford to buy them all shoes, so they have to share, but do I complain? No! I continue to offer amazing deals, such as first-time Beacon Beach customers get two free Super Mushrooms. My loss is your gain, and after this, if you want a full team heal, anytime you need to pay. Well, anytime except combat. So, yeah, classic. Refresh all your sparks and techniques for immediate use. Level up any spark with this delicious celestial beverage fortifying with vits and mins. Mysterious memory. Scopers. The Stooges. Oh, there it is. Sunrise key. Might unlock some atypical door on Beacon Beach. Maybe. And a bunch of weapon skins. Alright, well I'm going to save for that then, I guess. Wait, where was the sunrise something, 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 something? If you had to That's say exact size, you would be in a bad mood, too. Fair enough. <laughs> we got in a little bit of a, a pickle today. Um, because Chelsea's car, much to her chagrin, broke down in a, at a gas station. Um, crossing the battleground. Yeah, okay. um, which was already a bummer, because it was a pretty new car. It was like 2016. Seemed like something electrical or something. It just, you know, it wouldn't start. It'd turn over, but... Unsure, so we had to bring it to the dealership, because I'm no... Like, immediate car fixer. However. Hello. Analyst battle, so I can leave with you. Else I'm stuck here. Says who? You know, we were following a different spark earlier, but the more the merrier. There are a lot of sparks to deal with. Bad guys are pretty apathetic if they're in the battlefield, and they'll give up. Analyze both heroes and enemies, and use some browns between them. Each Time you counter new enemies, remember to analyze them, I'll help you understand their abilities and behaviors. Um, so not only did that happen, no, I shouldn't do that. Um, so not only did her new car-ish, new-ish car, break down, but she has to now drive my extremely... It's not that old, it's like a 2010, but she has to drive my beat-up car that she... <laughs> 
Hey, she was... That was the grumpiest I've, I've ever seen her. Um... Driving out today. Wait, I can pick him up? What does this do for me? <laughs> I can just... <laughs> just... <laughs> okay. Alright. Yeah, sure. I can do it. Alright. The, uh... The real worst part of that is I still haven't gotten my registration renewed, so we're driving semi-illegally until I get an appointment with the Secretary of State, and they tried to get me an appointment, and then they're like, just make it online. So I tried to. I really did. I really tried to. Turns out you can't renew things online, even though they said they could. And they're like, okay, we'll just make an appointment. But they force you to uh, choose one of several topics to make your appointment. And I'll give you a hint. Exactly none of those topics... That's not what I want to do. None of those topics are... Need to renew your registration. So I wasn't actually able to make one today. Specifically because of that. I hate the Secretary of State. Do they not just have to renew your tabs machines? That's where we're going tomorrow. But no time today because my day was taken up pretty much completely with. Three different. Um, I really should have paid attention to those two, huh? Three different. Ouch. People that are retiring, but still wanting to do a bunch of work. They're like two weeks away from retirement at this point. 50 and 50 ish, 55, 60, I'm not sure, on a couple of them. And they're just like trying to fit all this stuff in. I'm like, why don't you just. Chill out. Take a look. Just peace out. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Promise. But no. They're very committed. One of them was even really sad because, um,. Chelsea's car is a, is a Ford. And, <laughs> like, what kind of car was it? They we were, you know, really excited to see if it was, you know, competitors or something. And, like, it was a Ford Escape, and they're like, that's disappointing. I didn't have the heart to tell him she was driving a Honda. I guess I should actually check these out. They're long shooters, long range projectiles, long range two shot attack. They're weak to burn, resistant to frostbite. Hmm. Who'd have thunk? I much prefer uh, Rabid Mario's Hey, I'm walking here kind of voice. We'll find a combination that we can stomach. Eventually. Spark Mini, I'm at Final Exciting Heroes. Da, da, da. Okay. What do we got? Spark Management Screen. You can assign any spark that's joined your team to one of your heroes. Power and bonus granted by the spark. Choose your sparks wisely. Each of them has a particular power that could help you in battle. Burn attack. All weapon-based attacks are charged with burn. 
and deal 120% damage. All super effect damage is reduced by 20%. Heroes are not affected by the super effect. I see. Next level. Two. Believe it or not. Uh... Honestly, reach next level. At least one hero must be reach level nine. Oh, okay. Well, might as well feed them all star bits. Then it's not as entertaining as Galaxy when they get all chunky, like me with American Dream ice cream. It's not quite the same. Um, burn attacks. Burn. Interesting. Let's put you on there for now. Heck, fine. No. None of these people are Bowser, so. The hunt goes on. The crab on top of its head. Teleport flag of the map to use it fast travel around the planet. Yeah, alright. Apparently, Augie believes he's from a family of proud demigods. For such divine creatures, murals must be like family photos. Unfortunately, this regal depiction of the birth of Augie and his twin Perfectus Perfect. is ruled by Augie's chronic dyspepsia. It's relatable. It block push in town. Oh, baby! Why am I not playing Valkyrie Elysium? Well, I mean, besides the fact that I haven't played the first two games that are highly recommended by people, uh, it didn't look any good. And you might counter that with you play bad games all the time, and that's true. But but this one this one's out of spite. Boy, Goombas are intimidating. If you could defeat even three Goombas, I'd be grateful. Still too many Goombas, in my humble opinion. <laughs> I mean, I can't deny that. Look at, look at that, that's some Goombas. That's some Goombas right there. completely unrelated. It's related in terms of I don't want to play. <laughs> Would you just let me have excuses for once? That's all I ask. I guess I'm just gonna I'm just gonna toss you down there. Continue to use the healing here. know where the last one is. I have found the last one. Pow, pow. 
So did that count as three Goombas or one Goomb? That's the question. Oh, it only counted as one Goomb. Open. I guess that'll do. I obtained my first memory. Wow. Here I thought I had that years ago. While its state of origin is uncertain, the Sunrise Temple seems quite ancient. Damaged but explorable, it slowly revealed its mysteries. A secret passage leading to Beacon Town, a mysterious room filled with time-worn pottery, and a series of murals depicting the Warden's life story, which I personally found self-indulgent, perhaps due to an effort by Augie to garner sympathy. Nothing like a good bit of psychoanalyzation. Yeah. Oh. Trophy Augie won as a child was for second place in a Broadworth eating contest. Jealous, to be honest. Was that supposed to be negative? I thought that. I'm impressed. <laughs> second Goomb. That's that's a lot of Goomb. We could throw an extra dash in with, uh... Well, nobody right now. But eventually... Zapow. Think that'll kill. One, two, four. Also, skip that. I wonder if there's a way to just skip those cinematics every time. Did I did I not get to counter that? Alright. Sure. Sure, 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 sure. Doesn't really feel like I've got to hunt the Goombas down. The ocean is said to have been formed by the tears of Perfectus's hairdressers, who wept with joy while brushing his golden mane. Uh, 
still don't know about this. Why are there giant pretzels and cookies here? Two days for the dough to rise, eight hours to knead, and after licking the cinnamon glaze off, Augie tosses it aside. Augie's first job was to help sailors in distress. Sure. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, I, I'd be scared if Mario was approaching me like that. I don't like the vibes it gives off. Vaguely threatening. Hurry! We've got to go after that spark of light! Indeed. Without the spark, we will not be able to enter the lighthouse. Gee, that is far from the only reason we should save that poor creature. Obviously. Defeating the Darkmas Tentacle will also provide us with one of two purified Darkmas energy crystals we need. However, this creature's higher density of darkness energy, as compared to puddles, means our enemies will be more formidable. <sighs> That's what I get for buying you an off-the-shelf AI empathy module to save time. Okay. That was great. Good work, everybody. I am still looking for a third uh, goomb to stomp. I realize pausing in the middle of that sentence gave off weird vibes. <laughs> um, I guess the question is, do they randomly respawn, or not? Not, not so much. I'm going with a not so much. Oh god, not the speed donuts. Maybe I can swap. One second. Oh, yeah. Alright. Um, <laughs> I'm swapping them so I can hear his Brooklyn accent. Um, let's... Uh, skills. Yeah. Yeah, area movement up. Crit chance. Meh. Extra hits. Attacking doesn't move. End phase. I wanted the area dash increase. And the extra dash. For example, if I refund that, then I can get an area dash. And then... Uh, Luigi, what are you feeling? Feels like the high ground is necessary here. Um, and less damage drop off, maybe? Or a ghost bullet. Or an extra jump. Or just some weapon range. And maybe get some stomps going here. Just to make the team jumps a little better. Uh, da -da -da -da. Glide time. You can heal based on that. Extra damage. Life trade seems good. Might as well upgrade that now. Wider shot. 
and either extra or ricochet or I don't know we can weaken on dashes that sounds pretty good there we go it all sounds pretty good plus we're still waiting on the fifth year Gooms. What do they require? I can't imagine what could cause Augie of all people to abandon a delicious cheesecake. We'd best keep on our toes. Just that graham cr look at that thick graham cracker crust. Over it! Oopsie daisy! That'll give us some hello. How are you? Doing good. Good, good, good. Um, we got the AOE. Not that that really should matter. Maybe try to stomp here, see how it goes. We're just gonna keep swapping around for a while, anyways. Oh, too easy. Even if I don't actually think I can hit anyone with this range, nope. Somehow did not work, and I'm big mad about it. like a messenger spread the word so back in town Take it easy. Okay, don't have to turn it back in. That feels good. This is the greatest moment of my life. <laughs> Show me the Augie memory. Research into the Warden of Beacon Beach, Augie reveals a myriad of known traits. Insecure, attention-seeking, irresponsible, impulsive, cowardly, childish, gluttonous, entitled, dishonest, poor hygiene. Yet the ones that come up most often are kind-hearted and lovable. How these characteristics can be made compatible is beyond my current comprehension. I will have to investigate further. 
No, except for those 14 flaws. A really swell guy. Real nice character. Another just to reach area. <gasps> okay. Super effects can be applied to potentially anyone generating unique behaviors. Burn sets its target alight. Useful against certain enemies for you. Take care to avoid the resistances, exploit the weaknesses. Scopers weak against burn. Quick one of your heroes with Pyro Star. Uh, fine. You win. There we go. You might say that doesn't make a lot of sense on a guy who's low range, and uh, to you I say, here we go. Stay over there, but first we do that, which won't actually make any progress. Cause I think we've already done everything this turn, but it's okay. So, I mean, I guess we'll just stick here for now. We're playing it cautious. And pepper our cover as much as they want, but they won't break it. So. Oh no, what have I done? Just work my way around here. Perfect. I can't? Are you kidding me? Alright, fine, whatever. that 
kind of the opposite of what I was hoping for, but it's alright. Would love to have taken out the sniper first. Okay, for some reason I guess I thought that I would be safe here. But I guess... I guess not. Please let me team jump. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. This is fine. You know, they can't both kill us, right? Oh no! <laughs> I didn't notice them! <laughs> We're dead. <laughs> okay! I think we've already failed more than the entirety of the base game, so... Alright. No more disrespect. Only... only respect. Evaporation that gets me. Wow, water, water cycles amazing. I don't actually want to use that this turn. I just want to do a, a quick double tap and, and move on. this turn. It's nice that they roll individual for each hit there. So it's not blocked all or nothing, it's usually quite likely you'll hit something there. That would be a guaranteed kill, so let's do that. enough for a use case. Sure is. Might need to team jump this guy forward here. 
What happens if I jump you in the water? Just out of curiosity. It seems like a bad thing would happen. But I'm not quite confident. I'm gonna recover blown here. Well, just get to where we can get. There we go. When health isn't a setback, it just becomes another resource in these games. In X, like in XCOM, you're worried because even minor scratches can suddenly put you out of condition for a week or so, and it would just be very nice. Hey, <laughs> hey, I'm punching here. So then you have to invest in like hospital care and that sort of thing, but with here, unless it's an endurance battle where like. Cloud Strife. There's enough buckles here. All it's missing is being able to, to sheath it afterwards. Gotta be Bowser, right? Ugh, how many how many Bowsers do I gotta predict before I finally get King Koopa? It's not fair. Giant Wild Claw. Yeah, alright. Assuming we can trust the ominous stranger, having three heroes cooperating on the battlefield would give a huge advantage. Ain't that the truth? Um, well, my team's looking a little sparse on the, the old health, so... 
How about we try like a, a rabid Luigi and a, a peach? What do we got here? Got a sword. When thrown at an enemy, it ignores partial cover while hitting multiple targets along the way before coming back. Now, just take less damage. Okay. ZR. All targets within range are dealt 140% damage. If any of them move within line of sight. Like that. Oh, you advance anytime you get hit. Probably should. You know what? Why don't I look at you? Huh? Cannot be dashed, resistant to burn, ooze, splash, frostbite, shock, gust. Viciously goes after nearest challenger and unleashes area attacks. But the maximum amount of damage if attacked, it will charge its attacker in a rage, during which it will launch an extra attack. Okay. Wait, how much was that? 468 damage. Good to know. If possible, it's too edgy. You know, if possible. Barrier, just in case. Um, sure. Can I get any closer? I'm not sure that's worth it for the weekend. I don't think anyone else is in range to attack Peach, so that's fine. Alright, and that's why we had the barrier. That's why we had both barriers. Destroy them quick! More enemies are bound to pop out soon! Oh boy. Undashable, huh? Okay, um... This question is here, do I ignore... You? Honestly, probably. Fine, just in case we come under fire and we work to destroy the partial cover. One day. And... All right. Hmm. 
Oh, all right, all right, all right. Can I dash the port? <laughs> no. All right, fine. So I don't actually think I can take the portal out. If I was closer, still wouldn't do it. Actually, give me another turn, but let's see. On the portal specific. I didn't. Now, question is if we take out. Okay, so by just doing damage to the portal, it wasn't enough. Where? Okay. Um, I guess it depends on how far away you're gonna go. Also depends on who you're gonna go for. Cause we could just kind of mess around here um, with the team jump. And that did not help us whatsoever. <laughs> oh no! All right, we well, go. Such is life. I think we're out of the range of the boss, at Go least. I don't think we need the barriers yet.
but I probably, probably should have. Take less damage, receive less damage, same thing. Deal less damage. Wonder if I can get both of them in here. No, I can get neither. That's pretty good. running out of cover <laughs> rapidly. Um, let's do that. Drag you closer. Anybody gets really close, we can storm blade. Is kind of amusing. How about if I go here? That's more like it. Catch this. A little Captain America action there is pretty neat. Um, honestly, I don't know about this because. The damage that is going to be put out is going to be pretty grotesque. Like, how much, how much damage is here? Yeah, we'll take a lot if we do it. Let's get an extra attack off. we just hope you can't reach me from here and we take the damage from those two? Maybe. Hmm. For now, let's just do that. I'm hoping that our Overwatch here just can't... Ouch. Hoping our Overwatch doesn't get cancelled. Mm. It did, though. It really did. Um, F. Like, we might still be able to pull this out, but it's gonna be. gonna be tight. That's too close. That is just right. Sweet. 
And that's just us hoping... Well... Wait a second here. Yeah, get at least one of them. Whoosh! No crits, though. Mm. It's gonna be tight. You got it. It's not good now. Like, how much... Still is 294 health, which is pretty nutty. We're just gonna... I guess we're just gonna be running away. for a crit or something. Oh no. I, I mean, I legitimately don't think we can do this. Like, I think we'll just die this turn, obviously, but... 40% chance for 104 damage. I wonder if I just end here, use another turn to mess around with the settings here. How about here-ish? Oh, you've got to be joking me. Alright, how about here? Hit this. Like, beg for a crit. 146. And then use another mushroom to hope beyond hope. Yeah, because of that. It's either going to work or it's going to be a loss, and I'm not sure which. Oh, he got way more distance than I thought he would. Really should have just had a healer. I'm hoping it doesn't devolve into just healing the entire time. Oh, wait. That was... <sighs> really? I thought checkpoint would, like, put it at certain health levels, and I... Can I veto this? So we've definitely gotten through that. Or am I gonna get stuck doing this twice? Got a coin. I guess I didn't realize that was all one mission for some reason. It's been so long. 
All right. Well, that's his life. Let's do it again, I suppose. Except better. they'd move or not. They did. We'll play this as quick as we can, I suppose. Nope. <laughs> we'll get back to the actual fight. a bummer. We'll use our mushrooms now. And then work on single target damage, because. How far away are we allowed to retaliate here? Okay. Moving on, I suppose. I just want to get hit so I can watch a retaliation action. Yeah, like that. Perfect. I think they did the team jumps. Just right. Keep the freeform moving while still providing what the original did in terms of mobility.
think I have the range for that. Oh, you gotta be joking. That's gotta be the range. Yeah, right. If I do this... Run extra 20% damage, which I should have done before. Perfect. Skip this. Moving on to the boss. With a better team, which in this case will probably be like Rabbit Peach plus Luigi. Longer range damage, some healing if needed. think it's close enough right now that we don't have to really deal with it, but... This should cancel that part out. Be good. Don't care about that, and don't need to heal, so... Okay, never mind, that one's just dead now. Yeah, that's fine. Darkness portal. Got it. Just be this. <laughs> Might put reflect on in case that becomes necessary, but. We'll be okay just because we're messing with the uh, the islands here. Yeah. I think we're getting more of a handle on what this all requires. The game itself as well as the boss. Since we're playing on hard mode. some reason, I guess I just thought the Darkness Portals were going to literally overwhelm us, and it's really just like a couple extra. 
It's annoying, but it's not the worst I've ever seen. Let's just turn on Stormblade because at this point it's basically over. It did not work as well as I was hoping it was going to work. I thought it was going to proc that, but it's a little out of range. It is. Giant enemies. Oh, the memory. I thought that was like a mode. Like big head mode. It's big enemies mode. Excuse me, intimidating stranger. It's vitally important that the spark come with us to the lighthouse. Until we destroy the lighthouse tentacle, we can't create warp tunnels to other planets, and eventually to Cursa. Oh, bingo, bingo, bongo, baby! <laughs> that's that's the catchphrase he's stuck with throughout his life. You know, he's he's workshopped that for years, and that's the uh, Not it's the fun. best he's got. Her name's Edge. Edge. Just Edge. Yeah. Spaceship, huh? Speaking of help, I believe it's time we start keeping three heroes on our front line. Who'll take the first ship? I'll take the, the Cloud Strife wannabe. All right, show me what you've got. Yeah, okay. <sighs> Extra dashes, that's mean. That's a lot of dashes. Edge, area movement. Starting with first dash, each following does extra damage. Okay. Uh, increases the chances of a critical hit, yeah. Extra flying blade range. The halo area gets bigger. Or, starting from the first that each following does extra damage, extra damage from the overwatch, range, extra charge, when it's active we receive less damage. Um, I mean the extra dashes seem pretty good. Don't really care about the team jump. Just extra crit chance. I mean, 20% extra crit chance is decent. And... I guess I can make that 60%. Why not? For now. Might change that. I want to keep on increasing the range of the area dash because I think it's hilarious. And um, the I mean, honestly, the weapon damage needs to be better for Rabid Luigi. 
That's fine, that's fine. Uh, extra damage on that. Sure, 20%. Just make that heal be better. Uh, basic one here. I kind of want to do more stomps. And Peach... Uh, I don't know. Le less damage drop-off, probably, to make her more viable. Oh, let's go there. Let's work with it. New quests unlocked. To the lighthouse. Exosphere joins the team. Okay. Prisms have been obtained. Giant enemies, memories. What do we got? Curse's power is truly incredible, as evidenced during this attack by an enemy that has enlarged to giant size proportions, and not just due to their tremendous size. Battle analysis reveals they are immune to all super effects. Amount of energy involved, along with a delicate nature. They're rare. Okay. Bosses are rare. Understood. Got it. Where to next? <laughs> Professor Backpack. If only I could solve it. That would show him. Sir. This professor is a baby that had a mustache drawn on his face. People, this is the most celebrated archaeologist of our time. For once, we celebrated history. Ruins were uncovered, treasures hunted, discoveries made in the past, not just the future. These days, if something wasn't digitized, as if it never happened. Here to solve an ancient riddle. The answer to which has eluded explorers for centuries. But I can't solve it alone. The past is what ties us together. Will you help me revive it before his <laughs> sobbing in the background? Then someone's room, answer the riddle, temple of beacon breach. Yeah, that looks riddly. Manuscript I translated called it the Chamber of the Two Sons. You'll understand when you hear the riddle. King pins the star on his favorite son. The outcast runs away towards a new dawn. Go for it. I see. That'll get us the seven coins. Life. Augie was eclipsed by his older God, if I didn't know any better, this was this was leading into some like fratricide. Which, if we're honest, couldn't have been all that difficult. Okay. Favorite son. Augie. Goes towards the dawn. And voila. Planet coin awarded. And okay. what do we get here? Star potion. And I'll create a spark right away. What do you have to say about that? My gratitude, friend. What? <laughs> it was mostly about rotating the statues. The oh, poor. Ah, yeah, well, good luck with everything in the future. Or should I say... The past. <laughs> in war time, Augie was left behind to watch the livestock. It's how a flock of chickens came to briefly rule his city. Chickens are extremely large. F-O-U-S. The last straw for Augie's parents was when Augie drove the family sun chariot into the neighbor's swimming pool during Perfectus's wedding feast. 
harsh but fair. Locked pipe. Sparks required four of twelve. Oh, is that a gigantic Goomba? You had my interest, and now you have my attention. The villagers here on Beacon Beach really need to do a few background checks before hiring wardens. Wait, doesn't that trophy look familiar? Okay, there's that. Oops, don't mind me. What's down here? <laughs> Toad, what are you doing? I don't want to see an evil Toad. That's eardrum shattering, more than likely. Is that two? Okay, they can't have- they can't both have that much. Oh, it's just the get to the end kind of deal. Okay. I'm fine with keeping this as is for now. We'll just keep on the trucking. Except for Luigi, who will not truck. Sorry, Luigi. I don't look as big. Oh, so that boss that boss wasn't even a boss boss, it was just kind of a a supersized version of an already large foe. I can't tell if this feels like Kingdom Heartsy or like Christmas time at a Yuletide ball. I'm kind of good with it either way, but. Kinda looks like you're setting them up to get exploded. Hey! Wait. 
Yeah, that's a little bit easier to deal with. I can't hit. Oh, that's very frustrating. They still do run towards me, though. You can get me from there? How? I guess you'll bolt. Someone's gonna take damage here. It won't be as much as the boss, but... And I think Luigi is gonna take the damage, and if he's not... I would be surprised. Most of the damage reflected. It's not bad at all. How's that zero? Don't understand. Okay, whatever. I'll just do that, I guess. It's not like they can take... For like an extra star bit or two. And we're done. Oh. I also gave a planet coin. I'm okay. This isn't the first scary situation I've run into as an adventurer. Sure, 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 sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. More coins? I seem there's a limited number. That oh. work. Sounds good. I'm really interested to uh, see what is behind that secret door, honestly. Fighting random goobs. Not unless I'm forced to. Yeah. Wild claws. Hello. These creatures inherited feline DNA, giving them formidable predatory instincts. They rush their attacker instantly when assaulted. A habit we can use to our advantage to lure them where we wish. They despise contact with water and are resistant to fire based attacks. To my surprise, I find them both menacing and cute. A reminder that bioforms are complex, varied, and often hold contradictions. Hmm. 
Where? 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 Who the heck does green coins? Freaks. Green. That'll work. It's purple or nothing. The end. Anything else in this area? Yes. Quite a bit, actually. Free power block, thanks. Heck, this will just be a random encounter. I mean, the fun thing about turn based is that even random encounters can hold some fun little tactics. Uh, I mean, not always the case, but often. But I still obviously prefer the the, the true guided. Anyone else? scenario here. Because this is this is almost like a, just a random encounter in a JRPG. Set that up. Do damage. We triggered both overwatches. Mm, officially, we don't actually need to do. I should have buffed up the damage, though. That's on me. Probably just chill out here. I don't think you can actually get to. Oh, I was wrong. Ow. <laughs> That's on me. On behalf of everyone, my bad. It's a short run, but a bigger run once they get. Uh, Got it. Two east just might make it. Yeah, I don't think Rabbit Mario, for example, is a Ooh, that looks cool. A good matchup for those guys. Long range is the best we got there. Restore the paintings. Okay. Can do. What's it? Bite looks I guess. Yum, okay. Resting. That looks right. Is this a tragic tale told in four parts? That looks right. Which one doesn't look? That looks right. Oh, that one does not look right at all. Pit. 
That's better. Didn't realize how gluttonous he was. Perfect. Oh, surf and spark? Oh, okay, bye. Yeah, all right. I mean, I'll just keep on following. I'm just enjoying myself, honestly. Very pleasant. I don't know where that other exit led, unfortunately. Yeah. But I think it'll be okay. Once this trophy smelled of copper nickel alloy and victory. Now it smells like thin and hot bacon and jalapeno pork crisps. <laughs> I really wish I could figure out what these were. Or if they were important at all. Or if they're just extra ways of getting regular coins. If they're planet coins, I'll be upset because I want to try to collect everything. Do all the major battles, collect all the sparks, memories, yada yada yada. That poor spark is being held captive behind that barrier. Let's tear it down so we can rescue it. Not our first bob arm rodeo. First, dash them. Second, pick them up. Yeah. Um. Let's finish this. Sure. Yes. Pathetic. <laughs> Yeah. That worked out pretty well, actually. Trying to get in cover here. Just dead weight. That did dead weight. Oh my gosh. Hey! Didn't realize we were gonna be all devil may cry up in here. Why did I do that and not dash, you might ask. I don't know. Thankfully, I mean I've got the ability to do that, but... That's it. You do a chunk of damage, I'll tell ya. This, I mean, we've got ability to get through partial cover there. That's fine. Hello. Why is that? Why is that zero percent? Whatever. Okay. 
I'm gonna pretend that these aren't bomb bombs. I think that's too much health in a portal for a bomb bomb. One and done. Off to go. And with that. I kinda have to let this happen. In a strange sort of way. Because we need all the bomb bombs. The ba ba bomb bombs. Not that one, though. Not that one. Yeah, you. No, you. Alright. Officially upset now. Is that least? Manage. This. Please, thank you. One down. Two dashes, so. Uh, no, let's go here. Then let's do that. And the storm blade edge thing. Out of eight left. Uh, either way, let's go up. And let's make sure at least some of this comes out weaker. Go from there. I'm taking damage. That's fine. We might, 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 might be able to get all three this turn. Better. Just kidding. Stormblade just ruined that. <laughs> oh. Get a stomp off then. Portals from overwhelming us, or from existing at all in that case.
Alright. I mean, it definitely feels more like a Mario Tactics game when I'm actually fighting Gooms and bob and whatever else we will be doing in the next however many hours this game takes. Can't help ourselves up. And we're not forced to use Mario in it. Tunnels used to be fun playing, you know? Electro Dash, thanks for rescuing me. Got a second win, we'll get going. New Spark. Very excited. Alright, which spark are you and what do you do? All dashes are charged with shock. for me. Um, I think that would work better on Peach. Let's try Electro Dash on Edge. You can do a ton of dashes. I mean Edge. Sorry, I guess I'm thinking about the Incredibles for no good reason. You know how it is. Concerts postponed. Cheap beats. Sad. It's Augie Sun Lounger. It smells like bone sauce, watermelon juice, and mediocrity. That actually hit a okay. little too close to home. Watermelon's delicious. What you got to go to watermelon? Bob bombs. All right, nothing funny there. Just good deeds. All right, let's grab the key. And also this. And also this. And also this. All the memories have been bought. Weapon skins are next. Looks like we needed eight more coins in here, which is pretty wild. But maybe the lighthouse will provide us some answers. I can't do more. I'm not good at fight like you are. Until we meet again. Bye bye. Bye bye. Um, kind of terrified of that. If I'm being honest. more interested in what's behind the secret door. Unless the secret door is a secret door, and then, well, I don't know what we'll do. Captain Toad's treasure tracker is going on here. Reach the spark. You got it, boss. <laughs> I don't 
feel like fighting any of these guys, so we're just gonna chill out the best we can. down. Yeah, all right. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, okay. A loudspeaker spark. I wonder if that just makes our AoEs bigger. I don't like the, the red guys either. They're too scary. Screech! Thank you for rescuing. Stuck here for it seems like forever. Oh, he's not in charge still, is he? one do. Enemies within range are repelled from... Whoops, gotta go. Enemies within range are repelled from the hero's position and increases chance of critical hits from weapons by 10%. That kind of seems perfect for uh, Rabid Mario. You punch him, you get in close, you give him the old 1, 2, slash 3, then you skadoosh away. It's a big oh, ass. Convinced you can pizza. cause pollinate a tree with a slice of double pepperoni to hybridize a pizza palm. Screen. Actually, Augie, what do you have to say about your pepperoni based uh, breeding policy? Bingo, 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 baby. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for the insight. <laughs> bingo, bango, bongo, baby. And the little tippy taps of the of the rain on the uh, tops of the umbrella feels good to hear. <laughs> All right. Well, we gotta at least try it before we end the stream. Let's see what's in the lighthouse. It is, in fact, an entire new zone. Got it. All right. Well, in that case, we'll be back on Monday. We've got ourselves an interesting start, to be sure. Bye forever, or, you know, just until Monday. Hope you enjoyed it. If you like to leave a follower, just come back, hang out any other time you want. Be back on Monday. Have a great weekend. And uh, until next time. Toodaloo.